Oh, hello there, yes. Mmm, sunny. I have to close the windows, otherwise my face would be too bright, wouldn't it? Anyway, um, yes, today, the beginning of the RMT strikes and uh, the press, uh, the media generally, right-wing media, which is basically all of them, have been uh, in a meltdown for the last few days, especially with the demo at the weekend. Um, strikes are a £1 billion lockdown for Britain, says the Daily Mail. Yes, and um, yeah, they're throwing everything they can at this. Apart from negotiations, obviously. Yes, um, uh, there's been a lot of talk, I think I pointed this out last week, about the pay for train drivers. And there are two problems around the pay for train drivers. Number one, um, a lot of journalists don't seem to know what the word average means. It doesn't mean median, guys. That's not what an average is. We don't use that word for an average. But it's kind of convenient. So we have Mr. Snaps uh, saying the median salary for the rail sector is £44,000, which is significantly above the median salary in the country. The RMT contests this, however, saying the figures used by the government are too high, and this is because the government includes train drivers, which are represented by a different union, ASLEV. Yes, indeed. Now, if you throw in train drivers amongst the rail workers, you do get a much higher figure, but because they're skilled workers, you'd expect them to be paid more than a cleaner. But the government isn't going to tell you that, is they? Are they? No. Um, yeah, um, my thoughts on this today are um, I wish uh, the comrades in the RMT well. Um, I hope that they get what they want. It will make it easier for the rest of us to put in reasonable wage demands. Uh, I'm a teacher and I've seen my wage fall. Something in the region is approaching 20% in the last 12 years. So... I'm afraid with people like me, you're going to find it hard to um, throw rocks at the RMT. If you do get a chance, um, have a look at the RMT's Twitter feed. Um, whoever is running their feed uh, um, has a wickedly wonderful sense of humour, as well as a great way of kind of answering those pertinent questions about nurses being paid things. Uh, final thought for the day um, from uh, the Metro um, is that the government um, are going to announce that basically people in the city on huge amounts of money are going to be allowed to earn a great deal more, which is a lovely announcement on a day when the government is suggesting that ordinary people pay for their economic incompetence. Yes. Anyway, um, tells you everything you need to know about the government in terms of the level of contempt they have for ordinary people by simply allowing a story like this out. But I guess it doesn't mean that we're talking about a story mysteriously disappearing from the times. Anyway, have a lovely day. Um, I'm going to teach a pupil about mean, median and mode this morning. Maybe I should include some journalists, eh? Hmm. Take care.